Hello everybody and welcome to the channel. Today I wanted to take a look at the tier 6 shovels just to see the differences. I've always been intrigued by how the stone shovel compares to the iron shovel compares to the steel shovel. Now we know the steel shovel is going to be more powerful in general. <clears throat> but can you get away since these tier 6 stone shovels do drop all the time. Can you get away with having one as your primary shovel of choice? Especially with these uh, dig quests and the buried treasures and, you know, all the stuff that takes a long time to do. You want to be as efficient as possible. And I know there's some tricks. You can set some, you know, some uh, some frames around the perimeter. See where the circle is shrinking towards and that gives you an idea. But let's just say, for uh, example, you're on a hill. You've got a buried treasure. It's kind of a funky circle. And you just don't know quite where to dig. So that's what I wanted to take a look at. And if you see here, I got into admin mode and just added some of the mods that I know you can use on these shovels. I guess the top four are going to be the Grave Digger, I would say. Grave Digger is going to be one. I think we can use the way we can use the wood splitter in that. Let's use the, uh, the structural brace. It's going to give us a little bit better degradation or lesser degradation. And this is going to give us a little more stamina. And I think these are just going to be... Damage against stone, damage against iron, damage against wood. Let's put the flaming mod on there. So that got us up to 18 points of melee, 30 points. That's what we want. We want Well, actually, what we want is the block damage. So we're at 72 block damage now. And if I look at that and compare it to the iron shovel, we can see... Actually, let me get out of this real quick. And if I hover over the iron shovel, you'll see that the stone shovel is actually two better than a non-modded iron shovel with all these mods in it. So when we look at the stone shovel completely modded, we have 72 block damage now. Four mods in there. If we compare that to the iron shovel, that's at 67. So that's a little bump up, right? And then if we look at the, uh, let's see, like I said, the steel shovel is gonna be the winner. Very tough to find. You won't find it till mid to late game anyway. Unless you're super lucky and you make one, something like that. Then you, that means you found a crucible or you found enough steel or you just harvested enough steel to make one. Entirely possible. But in this example, let's just see our stone shovel completely modded. 72 block damage. And the whole goal is, whoops, not that one. Let's go over here. The whole goal is, can I use this as my full-time shovel? Now, I should also note, I don't have any perks added to this player. This is all raw. And by default, not bad. I do have the, I got the boots on. Get me out of holes. And we do have a ring of fire. So we're not uh, interrupted by any angry puppies. But just these little dig. That's almost one. If I did a power dig here. Yeah, it's two shot. Not bad. And I've believed this for a long time that a good stone shovel. It's really almost worth its weight in gold. There you go, Jasper. You take a seat, pal. So let's compare that now to... So what were we doing with this? Stone's doing 83 damage um, on that block. Which is actually more than I think what we set out. Block damage is 72. We did 83 on the first one. As you can see... I have no points applied, nothing to minor 69er, mother load, anything that could give us a bump. So that's interesting. So let's switch over to the iron shovel. We did 83 block damage with a fully modded tier 6 stone. What are we going to do with a non modded tier 6 iron? All right, so I did 67. Not too bad. So yeah, it's a small bump. You know, I would still stick with my stone shovel if I had it modded. Definitely. Um, you know, this is just going to do a little bit better. Yeah, definitely. So the stone, not out of the question. Now, the other thing to keep in mind, when I want to repair a stone shovel, I'm just using a stone. I don't have to... You're going to melt in a second. Don't get too close to me. I'm fire. Okay. Oh, you died too. <laughs> Bodies everywhere. And a puppy. So the thing with the uh, stone, I'm fixing this with the stone. It's not costing me a repair kit. It's not costing me a bunch of iron I don't have to make it. 
makes it a very valuable early game, even mid game if you don't if you haven't found a shovel yet, um, tool to use, especially for buried treasure quests, as I mentioned. Now, if I switch over to the raw unmodded, yeah, that's look at the steel's doing. First shot's doing 104. I mean, that's that's great. 104 block damage on that steel, and it is exactly what it's rated for. So it seems like the stone, we're getting the 72 block damage, and then we're getting a little more for these mods. 72 block damage. How am I getting 83? Ah, the Gravedigger mod. Gravedigger mod adds 15%, which is about 11 points, 10.8 points or so additional damage not shown here. So that's actually going to give us close to 83, which is exactly what we got. So definitely worth modding that. Definitely worth having whatever mods besides the, gra the Grave Digger mod on this. Um, these just add to your damage. But having this one's definitely a must. Now, granted, while I seem to be a proponent of the Stone Shovel, which I am, if you have the mods, definitely move up to Iron Shovel, Steel Shovel. By then, when you're finding these, or if you have one, you should have some repair kits at your disposal to keep these things um, repaired, working, and of course we're just doing top tier here so you can see the differences. As we go down in tiers, tier 3, tier 2, you'll see subtle differences, but I would say that top mod has definitely got to be that Gravedigger mod, obviously for the block damage, which is essentially why we want the shovel in the first place. That's all I wanted to cover. I wanted to do a little experiment, figure that share it with my friends, get that stone shovel, get her modded up, you can have her for a very long time. Thanks for watching, everybody. Make sure you check out the Deserted series, Blizzard series, Brain Damage series, everything Nuck has to put out. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Thanks for watching. I'll see you all in the next video.